I would like to think that it will be like that. Um, the season has started very, very slowly for a lot of teams. Um, Chelsea have not looked great. City didn't look great until um, Sunday, and they gave the best performance of any of the Premier League teams. Spurs looked with slow starters. Um, Arsenal had that terrible start against Aston Villa, and they've they've looked better now. They've got Ozil playing. So it, it has been a bit of a slow burner. So with that in mind, you would tend to say, with Liverpool being top of the league and having uh, 10 points out of the first four games, it was looking really, really good. So yeah, I'm hoping that it will be and that everybody will have a decent chance to, to fight for the title. Yeah, well, you look at the money, look at the money that Southampton has spent in the summer. So there's been a lot of teams who've bought decent on two or three players. There's a lot of teams, the likes of uh, the likes of Sunderland, who, who splashed out on 14 players. So for their own rights, you're thinking, well, us who've bought three players would like to have a couple more. And the teams that have bought 14, well, it's probably too too many to integrate into a side. So it's all been different, but there, there is, there's, there's a good sort of centre there of teams in the Premier League who will all take points of those top six that we're talking about. I think that is too hard to say, but I, well, I've been asked a number of times, team who I think can win the, the league title. And, and that, I would always say at this moment, because the way the teams are, and as we have just spoken about, is probably Manchester United know how to win the league over a, a long period of time. Because you've seen Man City winning it and played nowhere near the potential last year.